Okay, so today we're going to be making a video on how to install Dropbox at home. I'm going to go to your internet browser, and here I've opened Internet Explorer. Now up in the address bar, I'm going to type in www.dropbox.com. It'll take me to the Dropbox website. This is pretty simple here. We're going to click on the download Dropbox button right here in the blue. Click that. Now this is on a PC of course, uh, so you'll have to refer to the Mac video for the instructions there. Now my uh, download didn't automatically start, so I'm going to click here where it says restart the download. Let me give it a couple seconds see if it starts, but if it doesn't you can click that. And we should pop up here with a box asking me what I want to do. I want to click run. It'll take a second here. It's going to be uh, reading the file here. It'll ask you again. I'm going to click run. Now keep in mind you can pause this video, rewind anytime that you are needing to go back and check on a few things. So this is continuing to download here. And we'll just give it a second. Okay. Looks like it's about to do something. Your computer may ask you what you want to do. Do you want to allow it? You want to click yes. All right. So let's click install. It's going to go through this lovely green bar of progress here again. Let's give it a second. Oh, flash player. Don't want to do that. I'll save that for later. Okay. Now that it's finalized the installation, it's going to come up and ask me what I want to do. Of course, if you don't have a Dropbox account, you can create one, but we do. So I'm going to click, I already have a Dropbox account. Click Next. I'm going to enter in my email address. This is the email address you use to create Dropbox and the password for your Dropbox account. You've got your computer name here, you don't need to mess with that. Click Next. And we're going to do the, the free 2 gig. Of course there is the paid accounts also, but we're just going to go with the free one here. And click Next. Do the typical install, and we can click Install. And I already have an account, um, so you won't see this at home, but I'm going to click Merge here. Again, you won't see that. I'm going to skip the tour because we already know how to use it. You And click Finish. Now, of course, you could go back and take the tour if you wanted to. And you'll notice it populated my Dropbox account. I've got spinning, spinning blue circles, which means that it's in the process of updating. You'll have green checks when it's ready to go. And I'm going to close this here and show you another way to open it. I'm going to minimize Internet Explorer. I'm going to go down here to the Dropbox icon and double click. And it brings up my Dropbox window with all of my files here again. Now another way we can access that, let me close this. We're going to go down to the Windows Explorer button there. And on the left hand side we see Dropbox. 